Hello everybody, welcome back to Vegas Sports Talk, and tonight the Vegas Golden Knights will take on the Minnesota Wild in Game 4 of the first round of the Stanley Cup playoffs. The Golden Knights lead this series two games to one after beating Minnesota 5-2 in Game 3. Players to watch for both teams, so this takes into account the last five games, both, both postseason and regular season. Alex Petrangelo, he has two goals, Riley Smith, four assists, Riley Smith, four points. For the Wild, Eric Zanek, two goals for Reno, three assists, and he also has four points for the Wild over the last five games. Team staff throughout the playoffs, goals four for the Golden Knights, 2.61. That number is a little bit skewed from the empty net goal from Mark Stone the other night. Goals allowed 1.33. Power play 10%, penalty kill 100%. So they have not given up a goal on the penalty kill so far, but their power play was good in game two but they were 0-5 in Game 3, so that's something they needed to improve on. For the Wild, their team stats, 1.33 goals for, 2.67 goals allowed. Their power play percentage is 0%, their penalty kill is 90%. So special teams, I said this throughout all three games, will be very important tonight as well for both of these two teams. Goaltender comparison, it should be Marc-Andre Fleury versus Cam Talbot tomorrow. Both these goalies have been playing excellent over the last three games. Flurry, he's 2-1 with a 1.32 goals allowed, a 951 save percentage. And Cavan Talbot, he's 1-2-0, 2.32 goals allowed, a 936 save percentage. That game that they lost in Game 3 on Thursday night was not due to Cam Talbot. Vegas leads the series two games to one. Game 4 is in St. Paul tonight. And this is a must-win game for Minnesota. They cannot be down three games to one, going back to Vegas for Game 5, needing to win, and they would have to win two in Vegas game five and seven, and this is a very big, big game for Minnesota, and with a loss, that could ruin their chances of advancing in the playoffs. Minnesota's Marcus Johansson, big news, this happened in game three. He slid into the post. Um, he did break his arm, so he will be out for probably the remainder of the season. Broken arm is the injury update for that. And Pat Shreddy and Nosek are both game time decisions again for the Golden Knights. Peter DeBoer does not give a de definite answer on them but we will see during warm-ups later on. Both Fleury and Todd have been excellent, and the puck drop is scheduled for 5 p.m. Pacific, 7 p.m. Central, and the game will air on NBC. It's game four. It's a very important game. With the win, the Golden Knights will go up three games to one, and they will put a stranglehold on this series. But if Minnesota can tie it up, it would be two games apiece, and game five should be very interesting Monday night. So there you guys go. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe. Comment down below who you think will win. Tonight's game four, and I'll talk to you guys again real soon.